three more of these. Oh, I've got paint in my handbag from art. Like, that's kind of annoying. We're going to skip past the fact that I look like a bold rap right now. Okay? <laughs> shush your mouth. I need to really shush my mouth. freaking loud can you go i honestly don't care how bad this is for me i'm still doing my makeup because i literally want to oh my god i watched shot around with my family today the plot twist the freaking plot twist what's the freak? i keep freaking forgetting it's nearly one in the morning Shush. literally even just closing my drawer makes so makes so much noise it's so bad but whatever whatever i swear i swear i hear someone walking like no joke i hear someone walking it's okay it's the weekend tomorrow it's okay makeup is eating it's freaking because i swear if my dog hears one noise she's going to bark and wake the whole house up and my chair keeps We've got like two steps left. If I can get this freaking open. Oh, there we go. Featuring the random powder my mum got for me like two years ago when I first started putting on makeup. <laughs> Probably expired, but you know, don't really care. No joke, it has some like hard bits in it, but <laughs> don't really care. It's whatever. It's, yeah, it's literally like whatever. This is gonna make so much noise. Okay, we do have the scar. I'm saying it sense, but I'm not even going in. Okay, bye guys. I'm nice. Ready with me. Amy's literally in the bathroom, literally behind you. So you might be able to hear her in the background, but it's literally literally half past 10 um and i think my train's at like 1 30 so i think we're gonna go for a little bit of shopping then i'm gonna head over to the station but, but you know what i'm obsessed with now i'm now obsessed with the bobby brown prime and moisturize thing it's honestly now my favorite thing ever i can't use anything else it's so good it kept my makeup on literally all day and it's made my skin feel so much softer and nice at the same time it's so good um i don't think i'll ever go back to anything else so thank you bobby brown i'm so tired because we were literally up until three o'clock in the morning because amy decided she really wanted to go on hmtv which is like omega 2.0 so we're gonna make a youtube video of it then we realized the youtube video wouldn't be that good so we just kind of went on it for about three hours um and it was absolutely hilarious then I got tired at like 2am and I was like, I need to go to bed. Like, I won't get up in the morning. And I know I Amy mean, will just be like, rise and shine. She'll be good as new. Unlike me, who would probably literally refuse to wake up even though I've had 13 hours sleep. I love this new brush by Kylie Cosmetics. I got it the other day when I was with Owen. I absolutely adore it. Would not be able to go back. Now, I got these. I got two new. <laughs> I got two new bronzers yesterday cream bronzers i got the anastasia beverly hills one in the shade i think it's caramel yeah in the shade caramel and then i got the nars one in the same shade i mean just, just forgot which it was oh my god guys this isn't coming out why is it coming out please hold on there we go that's the anastasia one and this is the nars one um, I have a feeling I'm going to use the Nars one because I tried it out a little bit yesterday and I really did like it. And you only need to use like the smallest bit and then you just kind of like, you get me. 
I love this bronzer. Trust me, it'll look better in the end just because I'm shit at makeup and it only gets put together at literally the end of a makeup routine. So you gotta trust the process on this. Why do I feel like all my other influence friends like Amy, Kaylin, Naya, um, Eliana, they can all like do makeup so well that when it comes to me, I'm like a child. So it's good. Now we're gonna do blushity blush. What else did I also get that was new yesterday? Oh yeah, I got the Kylie lip kit. Then I also, if I can find it, there we go, I've got the NARS POC concealer. Because I get really easily influenced of certain people. So I have to try it out because apparently it's 10 out of 10. And I'm gonna hit I'm gonna be hit just that. We missed breakfast. And I was really upset because I was really hoping they sold Coco Pops, but obviously we can't even find out because we were lazy and literally stayed in bed until half past ten. But it's okay. Yesterday was so fun. We filmed so much content. The event was so nice because obviously it was the event for season one of Amy's podcast being completed. And I'm so, so proud of her. But it was so nice in the venue. It was like the food was unreal. Um, it was literally the best food I've ever eaten in my life. It was... Mwah. Why do I look so tired? Like, I look shattered for some reason. I think this is lighting. I just look absolutely drained. I think once I put some powder on there, I should be all right. But hopefully... Um, that should do the trick so i'm just going to put some of my huda beauty in the shade cupcake it's literally hi um no i know what do you need them for no i don't have any okay i've got my powder and i'm just gonna put it on my cheekbones I'm so excited to see Owen today because I haven't seen him in like a day. And that's too long for me. Anyway, so. I, I don't know how Eliana copes without seeing her boyfriend for so long because I literally cry when I don't see him for an hour. Like, when I have to go on like London trips and things like that, I have to like leave him. And it's like, oh, it's like leaving your kid at home. Anyway. There, I've done my powder, and I just need to wait for that to set. I look crazy, but y'all know what I like to... What do I do with all this powder? Y'all know what I like to do when I do my powder, which is my brows and my lip liner. So, let's get... Of course, I'm using the W7 Brow Grip. I don't know what I'm going to do when I run out of this. Probably buy some more, but I'll probably find something else when I run out. But I'm literally... I adore this stuff so much it's also like really cheap as well so i was like doesn't break my bank account like everything's fucking else i swear down there's my brows done i think i'm gonna use my new kylie lip kit you know see what's going on about this but i'm not using the lip gloss because i got told yesterday it's matte Ew. i didn't know it was matte anyway so i got it in the shade candy k how cute i'm just gonna put this on and then i'll be back to show you guys the result of it here's the lip liner and then i'm gonna put some gloss on uh, I love this. I think that's really cute. It's a bit more dark than what I'd usually go for, but I think that's really, really a nice shade, so yeah. Now I'm just going to wipe the powders off. And then do some powder over the top. Okay, now like I said then, I'm literally just going to do my powders, and then I shall be done. I don't want to tie my hair up, but I literally have no bubbles, so... That will be happening any, anytime soon. Okay, guys, I've done my makeup, but it's really not a good makeup day today. Like, this lighting's so bad, I can hardly see a thing. So, don't come for me if it's flipping horrid, but I'm gonna show you it. This is makeup for today. I'm gonna be quite comfortable today because I am traveling back, so yeah. But I'll see you guys later. Yeah, I love you guys. Bye. Get ready with me for my aunt's wedding. So, we was meant to leave 15 minutes ago, but my hair is more important. My, hair, my curls look so good. Mark Hill Unicurl Curl. Anyway, Anisa's here. Hi. Hi. Anyway, who likes my bangles? I love them. And I love my jewellery. This outfit is slay. It's like minimalistic, but then the jewellery, everything just it. jazzes it up. We're always matching. We're like two pieces. No one, not for free. No toes for free. Okay, anyway, I'm doing my makeup. I've already got all makeup on because I got back from being out in London. I don't know when I got back recent, like an hour ago. 
and I've still got my makeup on because I couldn't be bothered to wash it off. I know that sounds a bit disgusting, but I am disgusting. And it's going to take me even quicker to do my makeup because I don't even have to do my massive forehead because I've got this big ticker, tiki, I don't know what it's called. I've got that there, so I don't even have to do makeup on my forehead. Yeah, these are my Fenty skin tint. I don't know if this is still my shade. I hope it's still my shade. But I just want to be a bit more OTT. That is nowhere near, nowhere near my shade. But I just want to be a bit OTT for makeup today because it's the wedding it's the wedding i don't know what part of the whole wedding ceremony stuff this is i've kind of lost count there's too many weddings like my hair. yeah everyone do you like anisa's hair she's got it longer and darker and i think it's late before it looked a bit red it was meant to be brunette but it just looked a bit red but i think you look like princess jasmine oh that's so nice I went shopping so I finally got a new concealer and a new concealer brush because my concealer is empty and I've seen everyone going on about the Kylie concealer brush so I got that and I'm honestly not excited for this like I just don't know no you know I am excited but I'm excited for the panty pudding that's the whole that's the whole reason I went last time and I stuffed my face with panty pudding it's the best thing ever also can I just say this thing in my bobby right here don't come for me because I don't know I, I know it's a ticky or a ticker but I don't know what one it is but it covers well if I angle it perfectly it covers the this massive fat spot I've got on my forehead and that is perfect because it looks hor horrible and it really really hurts so everything is just everything is coming together I've just been sitting here watching Dubai Bling for ages though and I love Dubai Bling anyone that knows me knows that I love Dubai Bling I just want to be in Dubai Bling that's like my main goal in life I've been learning Arabic because in my in my future in my brain I'm going to be living in Dubai when I'm older and I'm just going to be like suffer I'm just like suffer and I think that uh, but some people say it's a bad thing but I love suffer my bangles are like shedding something that's going everywhere but i've been learned i've been staying dedicated to duolingo i'm learning arabic because in my brain i'm going to be on dubai Blade. i didn't think this through because there's a bit of an issue because now my forehead and the rest of my face are completely different colors but i don't really care because I, I, I it's just my family i do not care there's a color scheme though and i think the color scheme is like champagne gold teal and something else so my mum and all of that jazz they're all wearing teal and then anisa and i so like all the nieces i think with the nieces we're all wearing champagne gold and it's super and it's super super cute and i think it goes with my hair like everything is just coming together i literally never use my red beauty blush but i'm going to be using it today because i feel like being extra and this is a very bright shade this is happy it's very bright and very pigmented so i feel like being extra and bougie I'm actually really happy because my makeup is looking really, really, really good. And I'm basically done. And it's easier. This has made it all very easy because I already had most of my makeup on. I don't have to do skincare or any of that just. And that takes the longest time. I can't go with the fact that I'm literally still wearing my Tiffany necklace. I do not care. I've got, like, this big necklace. I need to got the choker one, which I'm really jealous about. But I've got this big necklace, my big earrings, and I'm just sitting here wearing my Tiffany necklace because this does not come off of me. This is a part of me. The main thing I'm looking forward to is Pani Puri, food, music, and gossiping with anisa that's basically it anisa's double my age she's literally bang on double my age but we gossip about everything like she knows all of my school drama all of my ops are her ops she may be double my age but that is how it works my makeup's all done and i'm actually really happy i think it's all looking really good i need to get some pictures though because my makeup is looking boom bam outfit boom bam i actually had quite a good shopping day today the only thing is it was freezing i think it's raining now it isn't very practical and i didn't realize that it might ruin my hair if it ruins my hair then i will be ruined my mood will be ruined okay i'm doing my perfume i'm using my jimmy cheeks this smells so good and it lasts so long bye queens also i posted on instagram so go check out at layla eleni k k hey guys get ready for school okay so i've got seven minutes so I need to be quite quick. I don't know why it's like in this lighting I look ginger. Like is that just me? Also my hair actually feels so nice because I did my whole hair care routine last night. As you guys saw but yeah I'm so tired I couldn't wake up this morning. As usual like I literally will never be able to wake up. Don't know why I did that at the end. Um, anyways, I don't really know what to talk about, so I'm just going to go through my timetable with you because I literally haven't done that in, like, ages. So, first period, I've got physics, which I hate. Like, I actually hate physics. Like, I literally just hate science. Like, on the first day back here, I was like, oh, my God, like, I actually, like, don't mind physics. Like, it's, it's all right. I literally hate it now. Like, it's so bad. Well, to be fair, I knew that I wouldn't like physics, so... But I thought I was going to like biology because, like, basically, last year, in year seven and year eight, yeah, we had, like, just science. So it would just be, like, 
them all mixed together so we'd have three science lessons a week and then like obviously some subjects were like biology some were physics some were chemistry but then obviously like now i've got older sorry i keep going like mind blank now i've got older they like put it in oh my god it's now chemistry physics biology and i thought that i was going to really like biology but i just don't like i hate biology probably my worst one actually but yeah i just don't like science okay i'm gonna try and get something out of this but anyways next i've got maths which i don't mind math <gasps> Oh my god, I have a math test and I literally don't have a calculator or a pen or a pencil or anything. Because basically, I lost like my whole pencil case, which I'm really annoyed about because it's like a Victoria's Secret pencil case. Um, well, it wasn't actually a pencil case, it was my makeup bag and then I turned it into a pencil case. But I've lost it like for a week now and just haven't got anything, which is really annoying. But it's fine. So I'm probably going to fail that math test, but like, oh well, it's fine. The next I've got art, which I literally like rushed my art home like last night at like ten o'clock because like I forgot that I had it. And basically you have to like draw a what is it called? A crushed paper bag. And it's literally so bad, like I'm not even joking, it's like the worst thing I've ever done. I'm just not good at art though, like I'm so bad at it. Oh, I didn't realise the time, I've got two minutes. Mm. What Okay, anyways, next I've got Ari, which I actually like. It's so funny. Like, honestly, the teacher, yeah, she's just, like, she's new, and she's just quite, like, she's quite odd. Um, and she, like, always tells people off, but, like, in such a funny way, and it's just so funny. Like, I don't know, I, I actually love Ari. And if you don't know what Ari is, I think some other people call it, like, RS and stuff. It's, like, religious education. Religious, religious education or religious studies. Okay, then after lunch, I've got geography which like it's all right which also i had homework for as well but i only did like half of it um so and i didn't hand it in either so she'll probably just think that i've done none but like it's fine but that's just kind of like an all right lesson i don't really mind geography and then i've got french which i've got a french test as well <laughs> you have to like write a whole paragraph in french it's like not gonna be good why, like, is this not coming out? Okay, but anyways, I need to actually get on with makeup now because it, I'm, I'm supposed to have left. And, but yeah, I'm going to have to revise my French in the car. But, but, like, I just don't really know what to revise for maths. Like, I literally... <sighs> okay, now I'm going in with my NYX concealer. I feel like I always do this. Like, I'm always daydreaming in my skincare, like, not having a clue, like, about the time. And then... I realise it when I'm doing my makeup and I have to rush my makeup and it's really annoying. I need to get out of that habit. But I know I always say this, but like I really need a new one of these because like it just like doesn't even like make my under eyes bright anymore. And that's what I like about concealer, like brightening. But like it just doesn't anymore because like there's just like barely any product left so it can't actually do that. And the shade is also way too dark for me because this is my summer shade. Why did I say it like that? It sounded like I was from Texas or something. Anyways, I'm going to open my cream contour um, and put it high up because that's how I do it now. What is actually wrong with me today? Like, I feel like... Oh, I don't know. I'm giving myself a little bit of the ick, not going to lie. I'm sorry, but I literally don't know how people, like, do get ready with me. It's like, wake up early and then, like, film your get ready with me and then, like, edit it and stuff. And then, like, I literally... I'm like, like I film it in a rush and then I'm like, I just post it, boom. Like put a caption and then post it. Cause like I literally, otherwise you guys just will not be getting a get ready of me because I'm literally in just such a rush in the mornings so because it's actually bad. I really need to get out of a habit of like waking up this late and then giving myself like two minutes to get ready. Like it's actually not even funny. God, it's literally seven past eight i don't even know like why my parents like don't call me and stuff well we always end up leaving at like quarter past ten past anyways um i'm literally always late to school like i'm never not late to school it's quite bad but like it's not my fault like i need to look good like honestly okay, okay now i'm gonna go in my trivial cosmetic powder and their beauty blender powder puff obviously because love that 
And I'm gonna curl my lashes. Then I'm gonna use my Be Perfect Double Ended Mascara. I literally find this so cool. So I love this like mascara applicator. Like, first of all, I love it. And then on this side, there's like a really small one and it like literally gets every single lash and it's just so cool. I actually love it. Okay, then I'm gonna use my UK Lash Lash sep Separator. And I actually love this because this makes my lashes like not clumpy at all. Alright, and then I'm gonna go to my To Be Tanned Lip Balm. I actually love this lip balm. Okay, then I'm gonna go in my Immediate Olivia Milk Mist Setting Spray. Okay, then I'm just gonna put my Sol de Janeiro 40 on. Put that run out then. Anyways, thanks for watching. Bye. Bye. I'm not going to lie to you, all the people who are hating on Leah Holton because she got so many likes, you're actually so weird. Like, I'm not even going to lie to you, like, you guys are honestly so jealous because she's pretty and she got millions of likes. This is not me glazing, by the way. It's not me glazing. Okay, maybe just a little. She's honestly so pretty, so I don't understand why you guys are giving out so much hate. Not to bring colour into everything, but I guarantee you if a black person was to blow up like that, it would be a big fat problem. The amount of racist comments that person would probably get, or they probably wouldn't blow up that much. That's just the reality of it. And it's honestly so sad that that's the truth, because it is. And I'm not going to put a filter on it and say, oh, da -da -da -da. no, that's just the raw truth. Look how cute he is. I love this so much. Also, can we, like, stop normalising getting experience? expensive skincare products that's not necessary like i regret buying so many like viral skincare products because they broke me out so much honestly not worth it literally it might be aesthetic and fun and pink or whatever color it is it really doesn't matter at the end of the day your skin's gonna break out and you're not gonna be happy about that honestly i regret buying products like honestly so much i mean some of them worked for me but not all of them some of them broke me out i'm obviously not gonna say which brand because i love the brands but it's just some products certain products that don't work really well for me okay quick little rant basically yeah yesterday i didn't go to school because obviously i was sick yeah so i didn't go to school yesterday and i must have been doing my shower makeup because if you're a girl you get it and my makeup turned out so good and i was so shocked i was like why well, can't my makeup turn out like this every single day like i was honestly stunned on how good it looks so hopefully it looks good now as per usual i woke up late so i'm kind of in a rush i can't Okay, I'm gonna have to finish this off camera. Bye, guys. Mwah. Good morning, guys. Get ready with me for my first day back to school. I have been awake since six o'clock. Six o'clock. Yes, you heard me. Do not ask why. I literally woke up so randomly, checked the time, six o'clock. I was like, hold on. I don't have to be awake for another hour yet. Tried to fall back asleep, couldn't fall back asleep. So I was just sorting stuff in my room out and stuff like that, whatever. But yeah. Am I happy that I've got school? No. And I've got like the worst times I'll ever. I've got PE today on the first day back and I'm not impressed about it. And I also have maths and I hate maths and I have geography and I hate geography and I just have loads of subjects and I just don't like subjects. And I really don't know what to do with my hair. Like any minute now it's going to frizz back up and I'm going to have no clue what to do with it. Hashtag hard knock life having curly hair. I woke up thinking it was going to be like 20 degrees or something tropical and it's actually only going to be 11 that no, no comment not too impressed about the fact that it's only going to be 11 degrees because i was going to wear socks today but i've decided to be clever and put tights on instead because that is not warm okay like guys let's just do my contour and move on um i'm just doing one side at a time because it is quite like difficult to blend okay so now that my contour's all done we're going to go in with concealer usually we go in bl with blush next but we're doing no uh no we're just gonna go concealer sorry about that um yeah sorry that, that school holidays went unbelievably fast like i'm not ready for today at all i think i've already said this but i just i'm not i'm just not right now i'm gonna use my dior blush i don't know if i said this already but i was originally gonna put my hair in buns but like the wind is extortionately fast so um i don't really want my buns being blown away and also guys it's my hashtag last day being blonde today because i'm dying my hair is top secret colored as of tomorrow yeah she completely forgot to do my eyebrows so i'm gonna be right back when i've done my eyebrows i've changed my mind already i'm gonna be cheeky and not do my eyebrows today because it's just extra wasted time i don't know why i did that in my hand but yeah we're gonna do my blush like i said it was 20 minutes ago here we go I'm going to be cheeky and put mascara on today and hope I don't fall asleep in class because if not it will smudge like always. 
I'm gonna put some highlight on my nose real quick so then I can do my setting spray because I finished my actual like face makeup. I'm just gonna be doing my eyelashes now and then I'm pretty much done. So let's do a squirt there. Okay guys, so I'm all ready for school. I hope you all have a really good either first or second or second week back. I don't know. But yeah, bye guys. <laughs> That flick went a bit crazy. But I don't think I'm doing anything much today, but I'm gonna talk about yesterday. So obviously I went to Ami Charlize's podcast season two launch event. I could not believe the people I met. Eliana Wormsley. I've literally watched her growing up like my whole life. Like I love Dance Moms and oh my gosh, it was literally crazy that I was speaking to her about so many different things and how I used to do gymnastics and literally everything. And I finally met Tulula. Um, I reunited with Lena and Alana finally. Met Ami again, Naya. I met Jess and Eve from Love Island. There was so many different people there. But guys, the goodie bags were insane. I need to show you. This is like the best goodie bag I've ever gotten. Like, first thing in there, GHG straighteners. Like, shock had opening this goodie bag i was like oh my god and then glow recipe nice in my do drop not do drops huge drops i'm i've got two of those now oh my gosh the paula's choice mandelic acid exfoliant i can't wait to try that out um this facial toner two eyelashes the sol de janeiro body butter which one's this the 59. Oh my gosh, I can't wait to try that out. And then, I cannot believe this. The Kosis Wet Stick Moisturising Lip Shine and the Kosis Wet Lip Oil. Oh my gosh. And then lastly is this. I think, I think it's a lip product. This is what it looks like. Oh yeah, lip smoothie. Honey Vanilla. That is going to tastes so nice this video is gonna be so long so i'm barely getting ready anymore but i just had to show you guys that goodie bag because what the hell oh my gosh but after the event me and Lana went to a few shops and i went to space and k and i got two new laneige products and i'm so happy so excited to try these out i did try them out last night but it's okay so i got the water bank hyaluronic serum it looks so cool i'm obsessed with how it opens like, look at that and then i've got this um lip balm in grapefruit and it's amazing anyways i need to actually start getting ready whilst i yeah yeah i'm gonna try out this now and oh my gosh i just i'm obsessed with action i might have to do this yeah yesterday it was literally so fun well guys how is it may in three days what the hell time is going way too fast it's actually scary like it's gonna be summer soon Ignore my hair. For some reason, this is really uneven. I don't know why this is going up. It's just not going down. Oh, there we go. I think I fixed it. There we go. Also, I'm wearing this white fox set. It's really cute. I've got the joggers on as well. I'm not going to do any makeup, so I'm not doing anything today, but I'm going to use my huge drops. It's been about three years since I... Right, I'm going to use my new little Laneige thing, but I literally just love this, like, the applicator. Like, I can just whip this out anyway and just start going like that. I don't know. I just feel bougie. Oh my gosh, also, Eliana has convinced me to buy some of Friday's lip balm. I really want to get one. So, I might get that. I'm going to do a little unboxing of this Kos these Kosis products. Right, so I literally love Kosis. <gasps> the packaging of that is so cool. Wait. Oh my god, so it's like a lipstick. That, oh my god, that's so cool. And then, let's see what this is. Oh my gosh, I never even knew Kosis had this. That is actually so cool. Wow. But yeah, I'm ready, so bye guys.